Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to enable a secret display mode on your Galaxy S6. Now the Galaxy S6 has a color calibration menu under the display category and settings and this lets you tweak the appearance of your screen a little bit. I'm sure a lot of people like the default options but to be honest most of these are either oversaturated or have a yellowish tint. Well there's actually a display calibration setting that has accurate colors without the yellow tint, but it's hidden by default. To get this one going you'll just need to install a custom launcher that's capable of creating activity shortcuts. The best one of those on the market in my opinion is Nova Launcher from Tesla Coil. So to begin head to the Play Store to install Nova, then press your device's home button. From here you'll be asked what home screen app you want to use for this action, so choose Nova from this list, then press Always. Next, just long press any empty space on your home screen, then choose Widgets from the menu. After that, long press the Activities icon, then drag it to an empty space on your home screen. From here, you'll be given a list of all the apps and associated activities that are installed on your phone. Just scroll through this list until you find the Settings option. Next, tap the Mode Preview Tablet option, which is the second one in the list. At this point you'll now have a shortcut to this hidden display calibration menu sitting right on your home screen. To switch to the more accurate color mode, tap this shortcut, then select Adapt Display from the list, and press OK. To clarify, this is different than the Adaptive Display mode that the S6 uses by default, and it's definitely noticeable in person. I'm not sure how well this will come across on video, but the oversaturation is gone and the whites don't have the yellow tint that you would get with the basic screen mode. One thing to note though is that this display mode will not carry over through a reboot, so you'll have to tap that home screen shortcut to enable it again if you restart your phone. But it's a lot more accurate and it doesn't have the yellow tint, so it might just be the best display mode available. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.